Speaking of Valentine's Day, of course, just a little over a week away, and we've got you covered with another idea for your sweetheart. This one close to home, mm -hmm. WPD. And safer. <laughs> yeah, not with wolves. Amanda Kins is live at Paint and Unwind in Rural Zimlet with details on how you can spend time with your love there and take home a souvenir. Yes, that's right. And, uh... I like painting with white because you told me I can't mess up with exactly. white. Exactly. <laughs> now, exactly. Now we're moving on to black though, right. is that right? <laughs> this is how we are. Yeah. Okay. Yeah, we're gonna grab our other brush and we're gonna start the black. So we already have our white moon. And then we're gonna go ahead and circle right around. Nice big circular strokes. Okay. And we're gonna fill up the whole background with black. Gosh, white was easy. Black is so scary because black is really dark. <laughs> Yeah, but you can't you, buy that. This is for beginner painters. I mean, you don't have to know how to paint because you walk people through step by step. Absolutely. A lot of people that come have never picked up a paintbrush before. And we walk you through, we break it down, real simple instructions, and uh, everybody leaves with a masterpiece. <laughs> and this is really fun. Actually, what we're making now, you're doing next Tuesday, so people can get a jump start on their Valentine celebrations, or you can come in and make a Valentine's Day gift. Right, and it's going to be our Valentine special, and it's uh, five dollars off. Okay, and we're we're making the tree up there. Right. This will Valentine eventually turn tree. out to make the tree. Yeah, and then um, next next Saturday for Valentine's Day, you are making another Valentine's um, Day painting, and you can come in with your honey, and it's a right. nice it a special night. way to spend the spend the holiday together. Okay. You make this look so easy. <laughs> if I'm having trouble already, we're only on the background. Right? <laughs> Time will tell, and we'll see what this turns into. But it will be some sort of a, a masterpiece. And no matter what, I think I'm going to give it to my husband for Valentine's Day. So he has to at least pretend like he likes it. Guys? It's a good looking circle so far. Absolutely. You know Amanda, she's good at everything. She'll have, you know, create a masterpiece by the end of the show. Yeah, and of course you can find Paint and Unwind also on our uh, carolinalive.com daily deal page. Yes. Go, go check it out. All right, well if you want to try something different this Valentine's Day, you could make a gift for your sweetheart instead of running to the store and buying one. It comes from the heart, right? Mm -hmm. WPDE News Channel 15's Amanda Kins is doing just that at Paint and Unwind in Merle's Inlet. She joins us now, and Amanda, that's coming along Ooh. very nicely. Progress. I, I have expanded beyond the circle. I am now um, attempting to put a tree in here, and it's going to be a tree of love by the time we are done, That's right, right, Michelle? That's right. <laughs> uh, talk about the people who come in here because you know you don't need any painting experience. You just kind of make it a fun, laid-back atmosphere um, that people can come paint. Definitely. Um, some people said they used to paint like many many years ago and then picked up a brush in a while and this was sort of rekindling that passion for art yeah. that they've been missing other people have never painted before and they walk in immediately thinking that they're going to fail but you know I walk them through it and they are all so excited at the end with their final results that they can't believe they did it yeah it, so, you know what neat. it really boosts your self-confidence and gives you a sense of pride when you finish something Absolutely. that looks good enough for you to hang right. on your wall and then once you finish one you can't wait to come back and do yeah, it again it and, starts to get addicting yeah, yeah. Yes. so you will see throughout the morning hopefully this will be somewhat of a masterpiece guys Looks good already to me. Yeah, if we know Amanda, and you know, as well as we think we do, it'll definitely turn out a lot better than she thinks. Like she said, boost your confidence. <laughs> All right, closer to home Valentine's Day, just a little over a week away. We've got you covered with an idea for your sweetheart. WPDE News Channel 15's Amanda Kinseth is live at Paint and Unwind in Merle's Inlet, already making her husband a Valentine's gift, right? Yes, I, you know what, it's fun and now I totally have a gift for Valentine's Day, so I'm pretty excited. Uh, people can come out and do uh, this tree of love on Tuesday or on Saturday. You guys are actually doing the whole Valentine's couple thing where people can come out and make a painting together, which is a ton of fun. It is, absolutely. And it's probably something you've never done on Valentine's, so switch it up, doing something fun. Yeah, fine. absolutely. We actually, we actually did it last year and this is what we made. Um, little Mod Podge on here with some paper and then a heart and so we each make one and then you go home and you can hang them up next to each other. Yeah. And you know, it's just a really good time to spend right. together, something right. different that you don't always do. Absolutely. Something to take home that you can remember the night by. Right, absolutely. Okay, and so now we're, we're uh, putting hearts on our tree right yes, now. Yes, we're doing every, keeping everything in the um, gray and black and white. 
And then we're going to start adding in our pop color of red and pinks. A little splash of color. Right. What are some of the reactions of people when they come here and they, they paint? Oh, people love it. Um, they walk in already defeated, thinking I'll never be able to do this. And then at the end of the night, they're um, already signing up for the next class. Right. It's, yeah. You know, as we mentioned before, it's kind of addicting. And uh, I know Cameron Keith is addicted to painting, too. <laughs> and uh, if he can craftfully walk over here, he's going a little outside of the tree of love. Just a and little bit. And he's making <laughs> his own little, what do you call this? Nightmare Before Christmas, so you right. know, a little different holiday Keeping with he's the celebrating, yeah. but it's it a looks Valentine good. theme. <laughs> and you know, you kind of, you get the opportunity to be creative and do your own thing yeah. if you want to. Absolutely. We love it when people come in. Um, this is our recommendation and how we're doing it for the evening, but we're always excited. If you decide I don't want pink or red and you want to go blue or green, we're like all for it. Yeah. Me, on the other hand, yeah, I, I follow like instructions <laughs> and I need to I need all the help that I can get, guys. Paint she's within thorough. the lines. Yeah, there you go. And she's just thorough. I think she follows directions well. That's a good quality, right? Yeah, my, my favorite is like the color by the numbers. Or, you know, it says <laughs> yeah. where there's a number four, use the red crayon. Just really plain and simple. Spell it out for us, please. Nailed it. Well, in a week and a couple days from now, we're talking about Valentine's Day. So if you want to try something new this year for the holiday, you could make a gift for your sweetheart instead of buying one at the store. That's where we find WPDE News Channel 15's Amanda Kinseth at the making, that is, rather yes. than the store. She's at Paint and Unwind <laughs> in Merle's Inlet, putting the finishing touches on her masterpiece this morning. Good morning. You know what? Nothing says love like a homemade present. And so that's what you can do right here at Paint and Unwind. I've been working on this tree of love all morning and uh, pretty much to the final, I'm signing my name. That seems there you to go. be difficult a little bit. <laughs> <laughs> but, you know, it was a step-by-step -step process. Yours, of course, looks much more amazing than mine does, but it's been fun. Everybody's and will turn out different, but they're all uniquely yours, and that's what makes it so special. Right, that's the big thing. It's right. yours. You made it. And people can come out here, and they can either make one as a gift, or they can come out here and make it together right. um, on Tuesday or on, on Saturday. You can come out and do a little Valentine's Day. Not this Saturday, but next Saturday, of right. course, for Valentine's Day. Yeah. And on Tuesday the 10th, we're going to be teaching this one again. And if you say uh, you heard about or saw us on on uh, Amanda's show this morning, then you get a discount. Ooh, nice. Yeah. Now, how long have you been painting? I've been painting as long as I can remember. Okay. Just, uh, you know, since I was a, a child and I right. took art lessons and so a few more yeah. years and maybe I'll be absolutely caliber, no problem. But in the meantime, <laughs> my husband at least has to pretend that he likes it, guys. Looks good. He should be very happy with that. I love the little hearts on the branches. Yeah, I'd be very happy with that. And Amanda's been tweeting a couple pictures, too, of cameraman Keith's uh -huh. painting. Kind of took a, an unusual or rather a different take on it. So go over there and check it out.